So what exactly is the Fed meeting tomorrow and how can you prepare? What's going on team? It's Ricky with TechBit Solutions and tomorrow the Fed Minute will be going live at 2 p.m. But what is the Fed Minute? That's a very common question that we got after making some of our viewers aware of actually just this. I can start sharing my screen. Uh, but tomorrow, uh, Wednesday at 2 p.m., uh, we're going to be experiencing Fed Minutes. And the whole idea behind the Fed Minutes is pretty much just to get a closer look on the thought process that the Federal Reserve had, especially in their last decision making uh, of raising interest rates three quarters of a percent. Uh, the reason that this is so important, it's kind of like a guidance when it comes down to overall earnings report. It gives us kind of like a deeper look on why they chose to take such an aggressive approach. For those that are unaware, the Federal Reserve decided to raise interest rates more last meeting since 1994. So that very aggressive approach from their traditional um, a quarter of a percent, this time it was three quarters of a percent. And it's no surprise, right? Well, inflation is at an unprecedented level, right? It's at a 40-year high, over 8%. And with that being said, it makes sense on why they decided to take inflation head on and raise interest rates at a very aggressive rate. But this will give us a little bit of a better understanding and getting us to get a closer look on the thought process that led to that decision. Uh, and this will be an overall guidance for up and coming interest rate hikes, which should be very, very useful as the CPI data for last month uh, is getting to be released, if I'm not mistaken, um, the start of next week. So again, very, very important time to see if inflation actually did peak. On top of that, I actually wanted to show you guys the economic calendar. Uh, so beyond that 2 p.m. meeting, which of course is super important, you guys can see uh, how much of an impact it has to the overall market. Again, I will be live streaming that here on my YouTube channel, so make sure that you subscribe. One of the other um, really um, factors or kind of like reports that I'm looking at is the mortgage application index. Uh, this will give me a better understanding on how aggressive or how much less people are choosing uh, to take out mortgages, especially with interest rates being so high. There is no question that the demand for a mortgage and or to purchase a property is going to continue to go down if inflation and or if interest rates continue to rise. As interest rates continue to rise, it makes it more expensive to borrow money. Therefore, if it's more expensive, you're, more, you're less inclined to potentially even borrow that money. And again, that's the whole point of it, to get us to spend less. And by getting us to spend less, then again, that's how the Federal Reserve can actually moderate the overall inflation rate. So very excited to follow up. Uh, the overall market played out very, very well. Not only did we sell off, we started in the red. Today's earlier video, uh, I broke down how TQQQ at one point today uh, during our live trading session was down 5%, almost 6% on the day. Not only did it recover, but it ended in the green 5%. So that's a 10% move from bottom to top. And again, we can calculate that just so you guys can see exactly 12% move if you're a perfect trader. But I don't know about you. I'm definitely not a perfect trader myself. I was able to close the day up a little bit over 18,000. I'm very excited to follow up to see if we're going to continue to add more to our position size, especially leading into those Fed minutes and or if I should be reducing my position size, anticipating a little bit more of a sell-off. Again, with the idea that the market is a little bit more inconsistent leading into these Fed minutes, this is something that you're going to want to potentially think about before you choose to take a very, very aggressive approach. I still agree with the overall idea that I think right now is an amazing time to prepare for the market to recover but it's also very naive to think that the market has to recover anytime soon. I think one of the worst things that you can do is not prepare at all. And then if the market does recover, you're pretty much sitting on your hands. So I hope that you know that if you ever have any questions about just getting started, you can either comment down below or you can message me directly. The first link down below is our private and free Discord chat, and I can answer any question you might have about getting started. With that being said, I would love for you to watch me trade live as soon as tomorrow. If you want to see what it's like to see me enter, exit, my thought process behind a trade, I do this every single morning exclusive to my Learn Plan Profit Group. So if you want to learn more about it and to see if it's a good fit for you, that's going to be that second link down below. 
Hope uh, that I earned your thumbs up. Please consider subscribing. I'll see you in tomorrow's uh, live for the Fed Minute. Um, and like always, let's make sure that we end the year on a green note. Take it easy, team.